Okay, we're going to demonstrate for you in this video how to do uh, a seven panel drug testing kit. This is the Core Test Drugs of Abuse Pack. You see this is manufactured by Core Technology. It's an in vitro diagnostic device, which means it's a quality certified medical device for testing. It's CE certified and ISO 13485 quality certs. If we turn the foil over so you can see the reverse, very nicely produced foil. Gives you basic test procedure instructions, including how to dip the, the panel into the urine sample and indicative interpretation results. Also gives you inkjet printed on here, the combination of tests. And this particular combo screens for cocaine, amphetamine, cannabis, methadone, benzodiazepines, methamphetamine and opiates. You'll also have a lot number and an expiry date. So nice and easy to check what you've got before you run the test. When you're ready to perform the test and collected your urine sample, simply remove the test panel from the foil. Inside you will find a couple of pouches of desiccant just to keep the uh, membranes completely dry. And here you'll see the standard format for this test which is a panel with a cover. Remove the cover and you've got prongs which are where you dip the uh, panel into the urine test. Maximum dip line on these panels is the bottom of the actual panel ridge there got an indicator arrow there showing you and then you've got the codings for the tests two on this side met and mop and on the reverse you've got the additional five tests so when you're ready to perform the test note the timing take the test panel and off camera I'm just dipping that into a sample you dip it for only about three or five seconds just until you start to see the pink dye running up some of the membranes if I bring that back on screen, you'll see that in the windows here, you've got pink discoloration. Now, the sample will be absorbed in there, but by just reapplying the pouch lid, you've basically got no contamination there. It's all contained nicely within the actual panel. And then you're marking the time and just looking at uh, these areas here for the development of control and test lines to interpret your result. Now, this is a standard format for drug screening whereby you're basically looking for a control line to form on every test membrane to confirm that sufficient samples been added and absorbed by that membrane. And then you're looking for the presence or absence of a test line to indicate the presence or absence of the drug. Now it's a competitive binding technology, uh, this. So basically if there's no drug in the system, dye is going to die bind at the test line. So you're getting two lines for a negative result and a control line with no test line showing at the indicative period for this test indicating a positive result. Now already I can start to see even though the back membranes haven't cleared on this one you've got control lines showing on all five of those and test lines showing on all five. So the cocaine, amphetamine, THC, methadone and benzo strips are all negative, turn it over and again on this reverse you've got the two further negative results with test lines and control lines showing on the methamphetamine and opiates. So as soon as you see that clearly uh, demonstrated, there's no need to wait for the full development time. You've got a clear negative test result on all five, sorry, all seven parameters on this test membrane. So it can be discarded, your results noted down for the sample and you can move on to the next test. So you can see procedurally, if you're getting all negative tests, they're very quick to perform. You're looking at between one and two minutes development time only before you can interpret your results. So if you've got a number of these to do in a batch, they really can be very time effective uh, screening tools to wheedle out all your negative results. That's the uh, seven in one panel test. This one we showed you is in core test branding, also available in UK drug testing branding. On that format and different combinations are available of the seven panel from our website, ukdrugtesting.co.uk.